All right. This is the demonstration on how to use Photopea, uh, specifically how to make the contact sheet assignment. So I'm going to share my screen. I am already in Photopea. It is photopea.com. And you come to this um, screen. You can go to new project. If you're doing, if this is for the contact sheet assignment, it is your last name, underscore, first name, underscore, and then we're doing LL contact sheet, okay? We're gonna do, um, we're gonna do an eight by 12 photo, eight by 12 create gives you a vertical white sheet we want to make it black choose your color if it's not already black come to the color picker drag it down to black if it's one of the choices you can click black okay when you open it up it'll probably be like here which is the gradient tool which is lovely but we don't need it click and hold paint bucket tool once you have the paint bucket tool selected, just click the background. Now, we're gonna bring in our photos. File, open in place, pick your photos. Um, they become very large. I hold down the shift button. which keeps it the same size. If you let go of the shift button, it does this. If you hold the shift button, it does this. I'm keeping my finger on the mouse the whole time. I did it around 1050, gives you a photo of this size. Now you just, just keep going, same thing, repeat. Put all your photos in here, just, just bring them in. All right. This might take longer if you have a Chromebook because probably everybody's images are pretty big. File, place. I'm resizing, I'm placing, I'm moving on. Shift, make it around 1050 in the H, looking at the H numbers. Yeah, whatever. Doesn't have to be the same exact thing, unless that's what you prefer. File, open in place. Same thing. All right. Now for those of you who have horizontal images. I'm gonna do two horizontal images to see what you can do. I'm gonna go with 1020-ish. Uh, All right, now my next photo is going to be horizontal, which I don't have space for right here. So I'm gonna move this one down, okay? Maybe I'll do a, a bigger reshuffle. Uh, I'm gonna move this one up this one down and then I'm going to place the next horizontal photo here. But the problem is they are all on different layers. Okay. So I don't need to do anything big. I just need to find the layer, for instance, that this one is on so I can move it up. So I look real closely. This one looks like there's my image. Looks like it's in the same place. So now I go to my white arrow. I can now move this layer around. Right? I can even put it right over this one because I'm not gonna click the image that I'm putting it over. Okay, there's that. Now I need to go to the image I just put over. I'm gonna go to its layer. This one looks right, click it. White arrow, move it down to here. Okay, now I'm gonna place something right here. 
I'm going to click at the top. It doesn't matter. It'll just mean that it'll make the new layer above it. So, but that's not necessary. Um, file, open in place. Um, another horizontal. Okay. Notice it's it, it goes above the the layer that you have selected. All right, holding the shifts, it's about right. And done. So now that's how you make the contact sheets. And then as always, file, export, JPEG. Save. Since you did it right the first time, you don't need to rename it. Save. And that's how you make the contact sheet for your image submission for last Tuesday.